Both the company that made the Sukhoi plane and the plane itself died when the Soviet Union broke up. These are the most important facts to keep in mind, although neither the Su-47 nor the X-29 ever progressed beyond the prototype stage, the technologies they helped establish are still in use today. The Su-47's design is reminiscent of a spaceship from a 1960s science fiction book, but it was developed in the 1980s. Even though the prototype was unique, it was never made in large quantities because there wasn't enough money and there was a fatal flaw in the design. There are many benefits to having wings that are pushed forward on an airplane. Especially at low velocities, they have exceptional maneuverability. Furthermore, they have special lift properties that enable brief takeoff distances. The Soviet Navy was an early adopter because they needed a fighter plane that could take off quickly from the relatively short runways found on aircraft ships. There are some major drawbacks to having wings that sweep forward, however. The flying characteristics of aircraft with forward-swept wings are extremely unstable. At higher speeds, the wings are subjected to extreme strain. High stress loads necessitate that the wings be flexible without braking, which is no small engineering accomplishment. But the Su-47's agility is unparalleled. It employs a fly-by-wire device to stabilize its flight, as its design makes it prone to pitching and rolling. As can be seen in the film, it can perform some fairly daring stunts. It wasn't long after the Su-47 debuted that Western experts began to wonder if the plane was stealthy. Although the airplane was not stealthy in any way, it is possible that it had a coating that absorbed radar waves. The concept for the undertaking dates back to the early to late 1980s. The disintegration of the Soviet Union was ultimately fatal for both the Sukhoi Development Company and the aircraft. However, although the Su-47 can be seen at occasional airshows, only one aircraft was ever constructed. It fell prey to its era. In the early to late 1980s, the idea for the undertaking was first conceived. The disintegration of the Soviet Union was ultimately fatal for both the Sukhoi Development Company and the aircraft. Although the Su-47 is occasionally seen at airshows, only a single aircraft was ever constructed. It fell prey to the cultural climate of its day. The military writer for the national interest is Caleb Larson. He writes about the politics and culture of Germany as well as European and American security and defense problems, and he has a master's degree in public policy. This essay was originally published in 2020, and it is being reprinted now because of its popularity.